This video shows how to plot a chart and determine your true course when your rod of flight is going to cross the edge of a sectional chart. So normally, if we were going to fly between two airports, we just lay our plotter across the intended path, get our plotter aligned with true north, by aligning with the lines of longitude and then read our true course on the plotter. But if we cross the edge of a sectional, we don't really know where to lay that plotter. So if we had two charts for the same area, of course, we could just lay them back to back and line them up and that would be easy. But we usually don't buy two copies of the same chart. So. For this example, we're going to be flying to Walla Walla, right here. And we're going to be flying from Ritzville. So we're going to be flying south out of Ritzville, crossing the sectional line down to Walla Walla. Now we could just guess, but that's not going to be very accurate. So, quick trick is to just grab a blank piece of white printer paper. Now the edges of the sectional give you only about two miles of overlap. So if we take the piece of paper and choose whichever side we're going to start with, it doesn't really matter. But along our intended course, we'll lay the paper and find a line of longitude to line that piece of paper up with. And then if we can align the top of the paper somewhere within that crossover area, so within one to two miles of the edge. And then just find a couple landmarks. Now in this case we've got a couple of little airports that happen to line right on that line. And so I'll go ahead and just mark those on the edge here. So this is Watson and McGregor, and you can see I'm lined along this line of longitude. So now, um, what I can do is find my destination airport of Walla Walla right here and I can kind of see it right through the chart and I'll just go ahead and mark that so there is my destination now I can take that piece of paper flip my chart over find my same line of longitude, get my orientation right, find my two landmarks that I happen to line up here, in this case my two airports, get them pretty well lined up, and now I have extended my sectional chart, and I can see my destination. So now it's fairly simple to drop my plotter onto the chart, strike my line and I can even measure my distance in this case about 61 nautical miles you can see where that line has laid on the chart and I can come right back over here mark where that comes across and strike my line here so that I have a nice line to follow when I'm flying. I can look out the window and use pilotage to match up where I am on the chart. So that's how you can easily mark a true course when your desired route crosses the edge of a sectional and it happens to be on the back side of the same sectional chart.